At a wedding, the entrance of the bride into the room is usually one of the most unforgettable moments. The moment when the bride and groom see each other for the first time in their most beautiful outfit is always extremely moving. Liz, 41, was about to marry her future husband, Scott, but when she suddenly stops walking down the aisle and makes a strange hand gesture, everyone, including Scott, can't help but burst into tears. Liz is accompanied down the aisle by her 16-year-old son, Dominic. She's greeted with loud applause as she enters the room, revealing her beautiful wedding dress. Suddenly walking down the aisle, Liz whispers something in Dominic's ear. The young man understands what his mother has in mind and lets her do it. The latter makes eye contact with Scott, but then the groom freezes, and when the young woman stops walking, everyone's stunned. Liz Shoesmith, 41, and Scott Shoesmith, 38, both from Sydney and Australia, had met on Tinder, where they started chatting after securing a match. They both had the same hobbies and interests. However, Liz felt that there was still something strange about this man, so the young woman had first kept him at bay. After the first date, she soon clearly understood why she had this strange feeling. As Liz said in a YouTube video from 2018, Our first date was super casual. We went to a burrito bar, but it was really loud. There was a quiz night. However, the volume of the room and surrounding people didn't seem to bother Scott, and these even helped give the young man an unexpected advantage. Liz explained, I researched him before our date like all women and found out he played for the Australian Deaf Wallabies. This is a rugby team for the deaf and hard of hearing. Scott was therefore deaf. She then said she immediately felt a click with him and so the romance continued. 18 months later, the couple became engaged, but something completely unexpected was going to happen during their marriage. Usually things like flowers, bridesmaids, dresses, or the guest list are some of the main questions to sort out to finish a planning a wedding. For Liz, it was different. The young bride spent the very busy month leading up to her wedding alongside a teacher who taught her something special. It was so special that the surprise dedicated to her husband ended up going viral around the world. Liz and Scott's wedding ceremony is intended to be small and simple. It must take place in a small committee and barely 45 friends and close relatives attend. On this special day, Liz appears looking gorgeous in the small room and walks down the aisle alongside Dominic. Meanwhile, Naomi, her 19-year-old daughter, watches from the crowd just as emotional as the rest of the guests. But as the bride-to-be and her son begin to walk down the aisle, they suddenly decide to stop. Although Scott is deaf, I've never felt so well heard in my entire life. With all the joys brought into my life over the past few years, I wanted to surprise him when I walked in, Liz said. We can say that the future Australian bride went to great lengths to perfectly succeed in the surprise dedicated to her future husband. She tried very hard to achieve this unique moment when she would enter the room and approach the altar. Wait to see what she did. The time has come. After whispering in her son's ear and leaving him at the aisle, Liz makes contact with Scott as if he were the only one in the room. It will take some time for everyone to understand why Liz stopped. But then as Liz begins to present her surprise in front of her fiancé and the entire audience, the applause mounts. People automatically start wiping away their tears and the moment is magical. A few weeks before the wedding, Elizabeth Shoesmith learned to sign the lyrics to A Thousand Years, a love song sung by American singer Christina Perry for a future groom who is profoundly deaf. Scott has been deaf since he was eight years old and never heard the melody of the song, but he knew the words. When Liz begins her performance, Scott can't hold back any longer. Liz takes a stand in front of her husband in the midst of friends and family and begins to sign with her hands the words of the beautiful love story the song tells. Although Liz didn't say anything during the entire scene, Scott still heard her declare her love loud and clear. The sound of the song fills the room and everyone can feel what Liz is passing on to her future husband. The bride couldn't have found a better way to declare her love, and Scott could never have seen this coming. Tears had already begun to flow in the eyes of the future groom when he saw the woman of his life making her entrance at the back of the aisle, but he couldn't hold back any longer when she began to perform the song singing in sign language which is understandable because he knows that it takes a long time to learn sign language. Fortunately, all this work over the months finally paid off and Liz pulled off her surprise perfectly. After successfully completing all the lyrics to the love song dedicated to her fiancé, the bride heads down the aisle to hug Scott. Scott reacted with a gesture that all the guests present could understand, even without any knowledge of sign language. When his future wife finally approaches and joins him, Scott points to his new wife and shakes her hand as if to say to the people, she is the best. Later, Liz said how she had lived this magnificent scene. Every time I practiced singing the song at home, it went wrong. I was very lucky on D-Day because I didn't make any mistakes. It seems obvious that everything came from my heart and not from my head. Our communication has actually never been better because you just have to look each other in the eye when you're talking to know what to say. Stories like this are incredibly touching. 
A woman was ready to do anything to surprise her husband during their ceremony and prove her love to him. Isn't it great to have a love so profound that it surpasses words?